The Blue Plaque Award is an international program that celebrates the links between important people or events and the buildings to which they were connected. The Heritage Stratford Committee is pleased to award blue plaques in our community. In 2014, a blue plaque was awarded to 46 Ontario Street in honor of Thomas Edison. Thomas Edison was born in Ohio in 1847. His father Samuel was originally from Digby, Nova Scotia, and his mother Nancy Elliott was from New Berlin, New York. They moved to Vienna, Ontario, and after taking part in the Upper Canada Rebellion of 1837, Samuel moved his family to the United States. When Thomas Edison was about 13, the family was living in Port Huron, Michigan. Here, he learned to be a telegraph operator. In 1863, as a young man of 16, Thomas Edison made his way into Canada. It appears his cousin, Martha Edison, from Vienna, Ontario, had married a man from St. Mary's, Ontario, so it is likely he had family in the area. He got a job in what was then known as Stratford Junction as a telegraph operator for the Grand Trunk Railway. There are many local legends about Edison during his time in Stratford. The more believable one is that on his overnight job, he was required to send the message six every hour to show that he was awake and on the job. As a 16-year-old who enjoyed sleep, it was reported that he invented a small device connected to a clock that would send the message for him. There are various reports of the mechanism, including from the man who took over the position after Edison, named John Duncan, but we cannot verify it is true. Another unverifiable local legend is that Edison lost his job as a telegraph operator after having almost caused a collision. This is a story even he once reportedly told a reporter, but Thomas Edison was well known for embellishing or simply making up a good story. We do know that his father told R. Lamour, superintendent of the railway in 1888, that the Grand Trunk had failed to pay Tom as part of his last paycheck. Lamour went about correcting this and later, with a small ceremony, presented Samuel Edison with a check for the missing sum. In 1933, the desk that was used by Edison while working for the Grand Trunk was given to his great friend Henry Ford for inclusion among the Edison exhibits at the Edison Institute in Dearborn, Michigan by the president of the Canadian Canadian National Railway. At the museum, it also states that Edison invented a cockroach trap while working in Stratford. In 1940, the city of Stratford put up a plaque in the railway station commemorating Edison's time in Stratford. Often described as a quiet fellow, Thomas Edison went on to become a very prolific inventor, holding 1,093 patents, creating things that have affected all of our lives. Among his many inventions are electric power generation, mass communication, sound recording, the phonograph, the motion picture camera, and early versions of the electric light bulb. He was also one of the first inventors to apply the principles of organized science and teamwork to the process of invention, working with many researchers and employees. While here in Stratford, it is believed that Edison lived in the upper rooms at 46 Ontario Street. Although his stay in Stratford was brief, Edison was part of the early growth of the railways that were integral to Stratford's beginning.